Thank you for calling BJ's. This is how can I help you? Uh, hey, is just talking to somebody else there. I was on hold there asking a, asking a question for me. Yeah, I can answer it for you. Okay. Uh, they were asking if it's if it's uh, okay when we come in. Um, there's you, got, you guys let people throw peanut shells on the floor, right? <laughs> um, if you do that, that'll be fine. We could just sweep it up. Okay, so is that or we can? You guys have peanuts, right? We don't have peanuts. Oh, but if I, so would I have to bring my own peanuts? <laughs> Unfortunately. So if I brought my own peanuts, because it's not for me, it's my wife's grandma. She's a peanut hound. She just can't stop shucking them. So my mm -hmm. wife's grandma will have no problem throwing them on the floor. I mean, we'd obviously, because uh, this is, she just grew up in a roadhouse, so it's just what she does. Right. I mean, if she throws them on the floor, we will be okay sweeping it up. It won't, it won't be too big of a deal. I mean, as long as she just kept it under the table that you guys are in, that's no big deal. Yeah. I mean, she'll fling them around a little bit. She's an old lady, so she can't <laughs> fling them too far. But we're talking about peanut shells here. Yeah. Okay. So we're going to bring in, we'll just bring in a bucket of them, and that keeps her busy. All righty. So that's no problem. Yeah, it'll be fine. We can okay. just sweep it up. Got it, because sometimes I call, I don't like having to make this call, but, you know, um, I got to, because sometimes when we take her out, we take her out once a month, and she just causes a scene, because she thinks this is okay to do everywhere, and it's not some Right. Yeah, I mean, it's it's not something normally that we would do, but okay. it's really not that big of a deal if, like, if she does, you know, if that's something that she normally does and she wants to do it, right. then, you know, we want everybody to enjoy their experience here. So if that's something that she'd like to do, that's perfectly fine, and we can absolutely just sweep them up. You know, it's not it's not like a huge mess. You know. Okay. Now uh, this is something that that y'all just do, or is this across? This is all BJ's franchise. Um. So we don't like none of the BJ's have peanuts or anything like that. Mm -hmm. And honestly, I've never been asked that question before. Okay. Um. So I would say. Like, I think it's just because you asked me, honestly, okay. and I don't, I don't mind telling the server that she's going to have to sweep up the section, you know? Okay, because it's not going to be you, is it? No, it won't be me. Oh, well, that's easy then, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Okay. I mean, I, you guys got the three the three pronged forks, too, right? Um, I'm not sure about that. I think our, our forks are, have four. They have four? See, that's the thing. I was told they had three. Um, like a pitchfork, nah. like a pitchfork, like a like a trident, like from uh, under the sea. You yeah, seen it's just a regular four four prong fork. You ever seen Little Mermaid? Yes, I have. I have seen it. <laughs> I I've love seen... the Little Mermaid. Yeah, my favorite character is the crab. Really? Uh -huh. Have you watched the new one? No, I won't watch the new one. I you said like... you haven't. I have not. No, I like to keep it classic. Yeah. I did see yeah. Lion King on Broadway, though. Did you see Lion King on Broadway? I have not. I've seen Aladdin on Broadway. I didn't know that was on Broadway. Yep. I saw it uh, earlier this, or in 2023, about almost a year ago. You see it in New York City? Yes, I did. Oh, my gosh. That sounds so much fun. Did the, was it, like, it was. Did they have the flying carpet flying around there? Yes, they did. They did have the flying carpet, and Shut it flew. up. It flew around. Could you I see promise you. Could you see strings on it? Um. Yeah, you could. Oh, okay. But, you know, at, at some point, the scene, it, like, turns dark, you know, like, because they're flying outside, right. and it's supposed to be, like, the night sky and everything. Because it's a date, right? Whenever, a date? Yeah, whenever it turned dark, you couldn't see the strings as much. Okay, see, I don't like seeing the strings, because I'm like, I'm thinking about the strings. I want to think about yeah. Latin. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I have to go see that. Was it expensive? So I went on a school trip. Oh, and that's we a good kind school. of just like, yeah, we it was for like my choir, the choir department. Oh, so you're a and singer. Yes, I am. Mm. I don't sing much anymore since I graduated, but well, but yeah, it was a school trip, and they it was like all included in the in the overall price for the trip. That is a not, just just see one show or multiples. Yeah, it was just Aladdin. Just Aladdin. Okay. Well, that's still pretty good, you know. It's better yeah, than a lot of shows. I've seen some shows that are kind of, honestly, they're not that good. And when you see one that's not that good, it's kind of like, 
uh, maybe I don't want to do this. <laughs> yeah. You know, maybe I want to waste my time on something that's not good. Yeah, I understand that for uh, sure. So they have a tiger in there too? No, they didn't have oh. a tiger. Oh, that's too I bad. Because that's yeah, a good she, character. The tiger, Raj. Yeah, she wasn't even part of it. Oh, so, uh, yep. How about the evil guy? What's his name? Jafar? Is that his name? Jafar. Uh-huh. Yeah, they did have him. He has that funny little beard. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Is that beard, that, that, I don't like that beard. <laughs> you do? I do not like that beard. No, no. If I saw oh, you that don't. in somebody, if, if my son came in with that beard on, I'd be like, you're not coming in the house with that creepy little pencil beard on. Mm-mm. Yeah, I would say that that's about as the worst thing you can do is have that little creepy little thin beard. Yeah. Yeah. I I totally yeah, but he's a fun character. It's, a, it's supposed to be. It's a character. Yeah. Yeah, as mm. to the look. Yeah. Uh-huh. That is so fun. What did you go to any restaurants in New York? Um no, we just kind of had fast food. What'd you have? I went to this ramen place. I don't know what it was called. That's not fast then, food. That's good. Yeah, that was like the only like sit down place. And then we just had like McDonald's. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. yeah. Next time you got to uh, branch out, I would say. Yeah, for sure. We yeah, were only there for a couple of days. Italian food is good there. I'm not a big pasta eater. What? What? A pasta? There's more than more than Italian to pasta. Yeah. <laughs> you got um. Gosh, I don't even know what else is there. I mean, they got pizza. Pizza, but... pizza is Italian. Yeah. Um, there's um. There's fish. Fish. See, I don't eat fish either. You don't eat fish at all. I don't like the taste of it. I can't. I just. Even like shrimp, any type of seafood, what I've, about I've crab? never liked it. Crab? I've never tried crab. What about clams? Never tried them either. Oysters? Nope. Well, so you don't know if you don't even try it, you don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Your phone's <laughs> ringing. You want to get that? Um, somebody else picked it up. All right, no problem. Take it to the bank. <laughs> Drop it in, yeah. cash it. <laughs> yeah, I think you should try some. You should try. You should gotta try some of that other seafood, you know, because it's the world's large. You just gotta try it. Yeah, I do. Cheese, cheese is Italian. Yeah, I love cheese had, too well, much. Then you love Italian food. You ever had Parmesan cheese? Yep. Right. I put Parmesan cheese on everything. I get. I got a little. I got a brick of it. Oh, do you? <laughs> I got a brick. It's the size. I'm not. I'm not joking here. I got a size. It's the size of like a shoe. It's a big shoe. I believe you. <laughs> and I take that, and I, I got a grater, and I grate it on stuff. You put it on the food. Once the food's hot, you put the Parmesan mm-hmm. on it, and you grate it on there. And then it kind of melts, but not too much because it's hard cheese. It's not going to melt a whole lot. And right. Then, um, and then uh, you just go to town. And it's, <laughs> I, I, I got kicked out of a pizza restaurant for using too much of that Parmesan shaker. Oh, did you? <laughs> I did. I was shaking, 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 and he just, they're like, sir, you you have got to, if you want to pay for that, you can. For yeah. the for the shaker? Yeah, but I mean, I was like, okay, well, if you want me to pay for it, you should have put a price tag on it and told me before I started shaking, if you would told me like, if, you, if they had told me six shakes or less, I would have done it. I'm not going to break the rules. I know that. That's why I'm calling right. you right now. Right. You know, I don't want to. I don't want to upset anybody. I want to. Everybody, you know, you want to just make it easy, make it fun. Yeah, for sure. Right. How many of you guys are going to be coming in? I think it's about um, nineteen of us. No, sorry, nine of us. Nine. Yep, nine. Well, we got, a couple of them are little ki- little kids, you know. Are you going to need any high chairs at all? Probably uh, three of them. Three high chairs. Yeah. Okay. And what time do you guys think you're going to be coming? Oh, gosh, I don't know. Which We have to see what grandma, how she starts moving here, you know. That's the whole thing. Yeah. She just, sometimes it's like the wind, you know. You just don't know which way it's going to blow. Yeah, I hear that. Uh-huh. You do. You got grandma? 
I do have a grandma. I have two grandmas. Oh, you got two. That's good. I don't get. I got zero now. This is my 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 wife's grandma, so it's it doesn't really count. Yeah. Technically, she's not my grandma. Yeah. But that's good. You got two. You want to hold on to them? Yeah. Yeah, I'm still young, so I'm trying to take advantage of that. How old are you? I'm only 19 years old. 19, and you're working there. Well, good on you, but don't work too hard, you know. Yeah, I, I I like to work hard, though, but I'm I'm trying not to, you know, do too much too early. That's true. You don't want to go and have, like, nine kids and stuff like that, and you got to feed them. No, mm-hmm. yeah. My <laughs> sister did that, and she regrets it. Yeah, mm-hmm. I, I couldn't fathom that. Yeah. I don't know if I have enough love in my heart to have nine kids. Well, yeah, you gotta love yourself first. And she had, she had a bunch of kids on nine eleven. Oh, did she? Yeah, she had triplets. They were born on nine eleven. On the actual nine eleven, like two thousand one. Nine eleven. They're old now. Wow. Yeah, they were born on nine eleven, and they, so that's always in their heart now. Wow. You don't want that because that's that was a bad day. Yeah, for sure. Mm. I couldn't imagine. Yeah, you weren't around for that, were you? No, I wasn't. You wasn't even born yet. I sure wasn't. I was born in 2004. That's good. You missed 9-11. You don't know. I wish I could have missed 9-11. Yeah, I'm sure that was a crazy, crazy time. I was on a bicycle when I heard about it. Nearly fell were off. You? Yeah. I was biking by a gas That's station. Crazy. Some guy yelled at me and told me there's just been a terror, and I... Pulled in to um, Best Buy because my friend mm-hmm. Jeremy was working there, and uh, we just we put it on every TV. It was, it was a wall of 9/11. Wow! So I'll never forget. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I had we had some of the best chicken strips I've ever had too that day. Really? Uh huh. Some of the best. Well, I guess that maybe made up for it, huh? Yeah, it kind of <laughs> did for me because I wasn't involved, obviously. But the chicken strips were just very good. And we had you ever you ever had honey mustard? Honey mustard, yeah, we have good honey mustard here. You do. We do. Well, do you like your honey mustard more like like creamy, like mayo-y? I do. Yep, that's exactly what we got here. Wow, I'm like it's how you really asked me good. That. I'm glad you asked me that question. You didn't say it's creamy. You said, do you like it this way? And if I said <laughs> if I said no, you'd be like, well. Unfortunately, ours is this way, you know. Yeah, I would have had to disappoint you. Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> I'm looking forward to getting some riblets. Probably, uh, uh, what's that salad that comes on the iceberg lettuce? Caesar. Um, I think that's a different or, kind of lettuce. What's the kind? It's got the bacon bits on it. Uh, the wedge salad. Wedge. Yeah, I love a wedge salad. It's fun because yeah. you just get a big old head of lettuce there, and it's got the <laughs> chopped onions, the tomatoes, the, all the dressing. Yep. It's a, uh, a blue cheese. Yep, we do blue cheese dressing. See, what I like to order is I order wings, and I dip them wings? in the wedge salad. Oh, really? Uh-huh. And then I... You like I, boneless or bone-in? I like boneless. Yeah. Got your boneless. We got a lot of flavors too. What flavors you got? We have buffalo. Okay, we that's have classic. A, a peppered barbecue. Ooh. We have a Carolina Gold barbecue, oh. which is more like a, a mustardy type oh. barbecue. Oh. We have a root beer glaze. What? Yep. Wait, hold on. We have <laughs> root beer glaze. That doesn't seem right yep. to me. That seems like a contradiction. Well, you know, it's pretty similar to barbecue, but you can definitely taste the root beer flavor in it. Wow. Is that made in-house? Yes, it is. With Get our root beer. With your I root swear. beer? Yep. Oh. Okay, keep going. I'm listening. Lemon pepper. Lemon pepper's a good one. Is that a dry rub? Yes, it is. Oh, okay. Um, or you could just get them plain, you know. Okay. Um, I think that's... So, I think so. Well, that's a lot. Yeah, it is a few. Yeah, we that's got quite probably a bit. eight of them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Boneless. Boneless wings. <clears throat> how many flavors can you get? at the, How many could I get? If I wanted to try all the flavors, how would that work? Um, I 
honestly don't know if we could do that. I'm sure we could split it like half and half, but I don't right. know if they'd be able to just give you like one of each, you know? Well, what I'm saying is like, let's say, uh, what's the most amount of wings I got to get to try each flavor? Well, the boneless wings in order, it comes it comes with one pound of boneless wings. So oh. it usually like in one order, there's like 15 to 20 of them. Mm. So it comes with a lot of wings in one order. Right. So, I mean, if you wanted to try all of the flavors, you would be getting, like, 100 wings. No way. <laughs> yeah, if you ordered one if you ordered one order of every single flavor, it would definitely be, like, close to 100 wings. I, I mean, could it do would that. be, like, eight. I could do that. Would with, you, and you would finish all of them? I would do it with some friends. <laughs> oh, yeah, you guys could do that. we could mix and match. You ever mix and match? Yeah, if you got yeah, if you, everybody ordered a different flavor, then you guys could all share. I like to mix and match, and I also like to grab and go. Yeah, I do it. Anytime I'm at the airport and there's a, they got a grab and go, I'm like, I'm a, I'm gonna grab and go. You know what that means? At the airport? Right? Yeah, at the airport. When you see the sign, any place that has a big sign that says grab and go, I just I'm like, well, you said it, not me. <laughs> just grab it. And get on out of there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What are these? Um. Um. You gotta have those. You gotta have those plastic sacks with the liquid in them. Uh, the to go. What it's type like of a, liquid? It's like a to go. You get like a to go tea or to go uh, lemonade. Um. We have to go cups, uh-huh. and we have um. Like a plastic. We jet. have these. Yeah, we have like plastic. We have a sixty-four ounce plastic jug okay that you could take to go it's like a bag uh, right? i honestly don't i don't think we have bags because my friend <clears throat> my friend my friend uh derek got one of these and he's kept it around for years and he uses it when he has to go on a road trip it's like a plastic bag it's got a handle in it and a plastic nozzle on it it looks like an iv bag but kind of wide yeah i think we just have like the little it looks kind of like um like a half gallon of milk Oh, so but it's stiff? It's, it's got hard sides? It's stiff? Yeah, it's more like of a hard plastic. I mean, if you, like, squeezed it, it would be like a milk carton where it, like, it would dent, you know. Oh. Actually, 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 I do think that we might have um, catering, like, the clear catering bags. Uh-huh. I, I can't promise you. Uh-huh. Like, I can't, I can't guarantee it 100%. You know what a colostomy bag is? What was that? A colostomy bag? No. Oh, that's oh, good. Oh, wait. You don't want to know what that is? I think I do know, actually. Oh, you do know? Because if you think you <laughs> do know and you're like, ooh, I don't want that, yeah. then that's what it is. Yeah. 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 I know what you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, my brother had one for <laughs> three months. Ew, goodness. He's nice, though. He's really cool. Yeah. Is he going to come with you today? Um, Probably. He can run so fast. It's crazy. Really? Yeah, he can. He can run faster than anyone I've ever met. Even though he he doesn't have a colostomy bag anymore, but when he had mm-hmm. it on, the doctors were like, "Listen, Jody, you can't." His name's Jody, even though he's a man. Jody, you cannot mm-hmm. run with a colostomy bag because he, you know. Yeah, that wouldn't be very good. Probably. All around, we get, we get yeah. fly away. Yeah. Yeah, he runs to work. Wow. Well, that's probably good exercise for him. Oh, he does. He needs it. If he doesn't do run at least five miles a day, he goes buck wild. Really? Yeah, he's kind of a crazy guy, but he's good. <laughs> you know, he served overseas for four years. Oh, really? Yeah, he did. But he's a uh, you know, he's a strong guy, very fast, but uh, has problems sleeping. Yeah. Yeah. Not sweats. What's your name? Devin. Devin? Yep, with a D. Well, nice to meet you, Devin. Nice to meet you. What was your name again? Heard that name before. Is that in the Bible? Elizabeth's in the Bible, and my cousins. I have a Elijah and a Nehemiah after the prophets. Whoa. Elijah. Yep, all of us have biblical names. So you've been brought up right on the good book. Yes, I have. That's good. I like to hear that. You know, you gotta, you gotta have a foundation in this life. Absolutely. And that's just you truly sure. gotta have a place to, with, with with which to to lean on and to look at when times are of troubled style and mind, 
you have to think mm-hmm. that where where for worth we are going to which that has seen asunder those who have been past us on the mountain for the eye of the river knows that with which it comes that is amen jacobians 16:5 yep uh, and that's something i live my life by i think about that every morning when i wake up i say the light of the river shines for which that he has come forth for the knowledge of the light is the tree that sprouts unto the bearer of the witness for the life that has come before. Have you heard that one Amen. before? No, I haven't. That's Thessalonians. Yep. It's a good one. It is a good one. It's a very good one. It's kind of complicated, you know. It's a little bit confusing. I think a lot of people don't understand what it means. But if you mm-hmm. if you go to study like I have, I've gone to study, and uh, mm-hmm. when you go to study, they will uh, they break it down for you, make it simple. Yeah. They do. They okay. Make... Well, I do have to let you go. I'm oh, sorry. I'm sorry. I <laughs> I just got caught up here, you know. No, it's okay. We had a good conversation, we did? but okay. you know. Well, you know what? We're going to come on down there, and uh, Grandma's going to have a great time with her peanuts, and everything's going to be just wonderful. Probably going to get a bunch of those to-go sacks. Um, uh-huh. Can you tell me the price on those real quick? I don't know it. Okay. Um, whenever you come in, I'll right. have that for you. Okay, I'll ask for it. You, you'll set me up. Yep, I'll be right in front. You'll see me. You okay, I'll me. see you. You got purple Alrighty. hair or anything? Well- no, I just have brown hair. Okay, <laughs> then I'll I'll know then. All righty, well, I'll see you soon then. Okay. All righty, bye-bye. See you later. Bye-bye. 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 Oh!